Hello guys and welcome to Timigate. Today I'm going to show us a simple demonstration on how we can set up a security profile on a MicroTik router. Okay, you want to set up a security profile because you don't want unauthorized access to your network. So I'm going to show us how we can set it up, then how we can export it, download it to our system and then use it on multiple other radios. The reason you want to export it and use it on other radios is because you don't want to make mistakes when you have to create the keys across different uh, connecting stations. You might make a mistake somewhere and then that device will have problems connecting to your network. So I'm going to just come to the file session here just for us to be sure that there is no security profile already created here. We haven't created any, we have not exported anyone. So to create a security profile, it's quite easy and straightforward. You click on the wireless interface that you're using as your AP. Double click on it here. Then over here, as you can see here now, all right, just to make sure that we are, we are on the same page, you see security profile here is at default. That's what you have by default. When you click here, there is no other security profile here for you to choose from. So to create a new one, you simply close this place. Come to security profile over here. Just click on it. You see the default uh, security profile here already. So click on the add side here for us to create a new security profile. Give it a name you want to give it. All right. Okay. So what we are using here, we are going to use a uh, static key required. Okay. I'm going to say static key. Click on it because I want to use static. I don't want to use dynamic. So haven't done that. The last thing you want to do is to come to static keys here. Okay and type in the key you want to use, right? So that's the key I want to use. I'm using this key one, right? So I'm going to click on apply and I'm going to click on OK. As you can see, the key here has been created. I've entered my password. So now if I go to the file session, you can see that there is still no security profile here. Okay, it means I can't export it. But if I come back here on the wireless interface, double click on it. If I come here, security profile, when I click here, you're seeing another one now, which is Timigate. So I can just click on it and I will say apply and okay. Automatically, that has set that key as my security profile. Now, if I want to export it so that I can drag it as a file and use it on other system, it's very easy. So I'm going to come to new terminal. Over here at new terminal, I'm just going to type interface wireless. Okay, then I'm going to say security profile. Okay, then what do I need to do? I need to export it. Then what do I want to export is file, all right? And then the file is delegate. Okay, I'll click on okay. That's all I need to do to export that file. Remember, I said interface wireless security profile export then file, file name equals to Timigate. Now, when I come to uh, my file session here, I should be able to see Timigate here. Are you seeing it here? It's already here. So now, for me to use this on other devices, it's quite easy. So I'm just going to um, minimize here a little bit and drag it to my desktop. From my desktop, now I'm going to come back here and let's assume that I don't have a security profile on this system. I'm going to remove this one. Okay. I'm going to remove this file now here. All right. Now I haven't removed it. As you can see, it's been removed. Then I'm going to go back to my security profile here. This one that I created. I'm going to highlight it and I will remove it. So assuming that this is a station device that I need to connect to the AP, where I have the security profile already created like we demonstrated earlier. So what do I need to do? I don't want to go through the process of having to create this and type in the key because I might make a mistake somewhere. So how do I import it into this device and use it? So what I need to do on this one is simply to click on file, okay? Then go to where I have the security profile of my system and drag to the file session here, okay? Haven't done that. I then need to import it. Then I have to go to uh, my new terminal and I will say import. I'm 
I'm going to say import file. File equals to Timigate RSC. And I'll click on enter. And automatically, you will see a message that comes up and says script file loaded and executed successfully. So I will now have to go to my uh, wireless interface here. And you can see that I now have Timigate here. Okay, so when I come here on the interface tab here, double click on it, and here over here, I can now choose Timigate as my security profile. Just apply and okay, that's all you need to do. So, in this demonstration, I have shown you how you can create a static key, then how you can export it, and how you can uh, import it on a station device. So, it's very straightforward. Remember, just go to security profile, and if the static key that you want to use, you just enter the static key there, and you apply it. Okay, then you have to export it into the file section of your of your device. Drag it to your desktop, and when you're connecting other devices, all you just need to do is to drag it to the file section of that same that new device, and then go to the command prompt and import it. Thank you for watching. And please don't forget to visit my blog at www.timigate.com. Timigate is spelled T-I-M-I-G-A-T-E.com. Thanks and remain safe.